Hi, I'm Adam from DoingNoDrama.com. Today I'm going to be showing you how to add a simple text effect to text in Adobe After Effects CS4. Now it's not going to be CS4 specific, it's just that's what I'm going to be using. Um, first off, I'm going to show you how to add a gradient effect to text. Now I have a friend who told me how to do this in Photoshop and he said that he used it quite a lot because it makes your text just seem a bit more alive. So when I started using text in After Effects I decided to see if I could do it to make my text a bit more edgy. This is what I came up with. First we're going to create a new composition, which I'll just call text1, text1 then, um, and then just simply add a text box, can't spell today, there we go, and then um, when you've got your text to add the, the ramp effect, you just go to the effects and presets, and I've already searched for ramp there, and you'll get the, the ramp effect. You just drag that onto your text, and then you have a gradient effect. Now that's quite dark, and you might not necessarily want it like that. And you've got the two anchor points at the top and the bottom for the white there and the black at the top. And you can obviously switch them around if you want it to be the other way. Or you can use the numerical values in the effects panel, and you've got the horizontal position or the x and y position. Now, as they are in the center at the minute, you don't particularly want to make them go left and right because it will rotate them. I'll show you in a second. Another way you can move them is to hold shift, grab the anchor point and just drag it and there it will stick in position. Because if you let go of shift, it tends to do that which is quite hard to realign if you don't know what you're doing, which I, I don't usually. Um, and then you can just simply drag these about, get a nice effect and you've got a bit of a gradient going on. And you can Play that to your heart's content and it just makes your text seem a bit more punchy and a bit more alive and, and changes the colours obviously. And there you have it, there's your gradient effect in After Effects. Now one thing that I will just show you before I go is that once you've done this, if you then want to animate your text a bit more, say oh, I, did, I did this and I wanted to make the text fly in from, the, from an angle, if you move the text, as you can see, the gradient anchors don't move so the gradient will move as your text moves now this can be very annoying if you don't know why it's happening and you might think this is kind of a cool effect this this sort of gradient shifting now I can show you a better way to do that in another blog but the way to stop that happening if you want to move your text is to simply go back to your project panel and create a new composition which I shall call main and then drag your text composition into this and then you can move it around as much as you like, animate it, exploding or something and um, the gradient will remain perfectly positioned I've been Adam from DudenoDrama.com and I've shown you how to add a gradient effect to your text in After Effects